I consider this slide one of the most important slides to creating and maintaining a good custom corrosion protection and control program. Operators need to become more familiar with their aircraft and the areas that are prone to corrosion. The best way to do that is to develop a detailed periodic walk around to check the condition of your CICs and review areas on your aircraft that are more susceptible to erosion and corrosion. I recommend doing this after a wash, which includes the landing gear and wheel wells, because those areas should be clean and easy to review. Let's look at a short video to see what this review might look like for your aircraft. So today, I'd like to give you some information on how you too can also do a review of the exterior of your aircraft. We're looking for corrosion, erosion, and CIC condition. So you're looking up into that cove area. So take another close look at that flap cove area. When you're done with that, go out and take a look at the landing gear and the gear doors and make sure there's no corrosion in that area. Then you'll want to move into the wheel well and you'll want to check the wheel well spars, the spars that run through there, both the mid and the aft spar. And you'll want to check for CICs, corrosion. There won't be any erosion down there, but you'll want to check your CICs very carefully especially around those fasteners. Those collars make it really difficult to spread the CICs evenly. So you want to check that pretty carefully. Once you're done on this wing, you're just going to move straight over and do the same thing on the bottom of the right-hand wing. Once you're done with that, you're going to move back to that point where you stopped on the fuselage, and you're going to continue looking on forward for erosion and corrosion issues. And you'll want to make sure that the belly of the airplane is clean. You move on forward until you get to about this area and you'll run into the nose gear, of course. Now you'll want to look at that nose gear very carefully. You're going to want to check and see that there's no corrosion or any issues like that on the, on the nose gear. Then you'll want to look into the nose gear well and check that out for corrosion and make sure that the CICs are all in there and they're in place and they're serviceable. Then when you get to the nose, you're done. You should be able to do this entire review of the airplane in about an hour. And once you've done it once or twice, you can do that. It shouldn't take very long. Do it after you wash the airplane you'll be so happy. Doing this review every 30 to 45 days will keep you informed on any current developing corrosion issues. Plus it will keep you informed on the condition of your corrosion inhibiting compounds. If you need help deciding what to do about something that you've found, take a picture of it and send it to your nearest Textron service facility for their recommendations. The goals of this review are to find any corrosion that may be just starting so it's easy and less expensive to repair. 